afternoon, my uh, sports. Here's our sports update for this Sunday, July 26, 2009. For our first sports headline, Kobe Bryant fulfilled his promised comeback. After two years, the NBA Finals' most valuable player, Kobe Bryant of Los Angeles Lakers, once again visited the Pearl of the Orient Seas, Philippines, for his Asia tour. On the press conference held last Tuesday at the Manila Peninsula, Kobe shared his chemistry on former rival Ron Artest, which now joined him with the Lakers. We're all good friends, you know, so I spoke to Derek Fisher last night. I talked to Ron Artest since the trade happened. I've pretty much been talking to him every other day. So you know, we, we have a very, very close-knit group and we're like a family, so we, we talk we talk often. Then a humble Kobe was talking about Michael Thompson's comment that Kobe Bryant's basketball skills are better than his okay. Ernest yeah. Michael you know, Jordan. It's, to me, it's, it's to compare uh, myself with players that have come before me, particularly, particularly players that I've learned a great deal from, is uh, would be disrespectful to the knowledge that they share with me. So now, I can't sit here and compare and say I'm better than I have more skills than Michael, more skills than Jerry West or Oscar Robinson. I mean, these guys are instrumental in my growth and my development as a player. So you know, it would be a disservice after the press con, thousands of fans welcomed Kobe at the Bonifacio High Street. People wearing Kobe's jersey and hats. And some even bought Kobe miniatures. Then Kobe gave his new pair of basketball shoes dream season to a father and son and the girl screaming, I love you Kobe. I love you Kobe. I love you. Kobe, known for loving children, donated 100,000 pesos to Gawad Kalinga, supporting the dreams of young basketball.